Let me put it to you this way. Tom Surgeon, Jim Riley, Trevor Rieger, Joe Zillig, Harry Race, Bernard LaChance, DJ Day, Bella Morad, Perlita Jones, Quinn Wands, Elton Anderson, Don Riley, Jim Hall, Bill Duvall, Doug King, 1961, Oyster Cracker Man, GPS, Pestle Robo, Rapist Knight, and the Ellery's, Charles D. Ellery. And you guys, this is Little Crimes, Free Boast of, you know, Comic Book Boy, Tomb Raider Boy, McDonald's Rapist, Chair Rapist, Barnyard Rapist, all that stuff, the Big Bug story, everything that you got to do, and your associates there. So, I didn't, my, my, I, when I tried to re get recruited in the Air Force, I didn't score high enough on my test. And so my father said, all I'd be good for is infiltrate. Okay? And so, like I said, selective service, we already have to sign up for it, so I just offered my services here. Okay? And so, Perlita Jones, Ellery, Charles, Bernard Lachance, as the saying goes, he who wins the battles writes the history, he who wins the war writes the history. Okay? So I let you all win the battle. Karen Fausta, Come Three Western, Brian, Stan, Steve, Perlita Jones, make your crybaby fit, and, you know, your team there, Bernard, Dave, Perlita. So you guys get to write your battle and have your victory. You guys claimed your victory and your dictatorship, Perlita. And so, Joe, Indian Joe, Harry, Perlita, Dave, Ellery's Robo Knight in your team. They let you guys write your history. So when you tell your story and your rumors and your lies, your story can be tracked. Guess what? They have Perlita, the spoiled Perlita, and you, Joe, and Ari, and you guys' little, and Dave, you guys' adventure all around the planet, Carney Bernard. Because you took advantage of the situation multiple times. That's what I'm saying. You guys just go, oh, take it. And guess what? Because of that, you guys, you're in a heap of shit. And that's all that guy has ever done. So I let, I let Oyster Cracker Man tell his story and write his battle. But it can be tracked. Same with Elton. Same with Don Wiley, Team Purple. Same with Ellery. Same. Oh, as Ellery stole shit. As Joe crashed shit. So the more and more that the group of you took advantage of Jay Beswick, Aina Beswick, those three girls, the Pueller girls, um, the Hilton's Bowmans and Kennedy's, uh, let's see who else, Mel Cove, Colin Powell, the Joint Chiefs of Staff, any of the military branches, FBI, CIA, any of the police, firefighter, any of that, the worst it keeps getting for the group of you because of your elitist attitudes and ego to always win. I told you, Harry, you see what happens when you guys pushed us kids out in the beginning and all that crap happened? The girls got pissed because you guys screwed it up. Then you guys do the same thing here. Then they get pissed because you guys screw it up. Starting to get it, Joe? Michigan -y Joe? Understand that I'm not interested your your war story about how great of an Indian man are or whatever country and western whatever you thread the force can be tracked Harry See I can tell how you're lied about me and Heather Harry Karen You're lying about Sasha Not DJ Sasha, but Sasha Imes a lot of those kids if you guys lie about any of those kids at Dalton Columbia Smoky Hill Rains view any of the universities. Um, let's see. Quartz High. Guess what? That's why you don't... See, see Harry, you don't want to prop like John in as Messiah or Dave or Adam. Because you guys make a big deal out of it. You use it as your war tool and then you adults like to sit on top of it as the great victories. So, that's why I say I'm not God. And that's why I tell them. Because I actually, I care about my friends. So I want, you know, don't want them to get hurt. Now, those of you who want to take advantage of it, you can. But guess what? It reveals 
what this story really was, even during your cover-up, Harry and Joe and Bernard, for like the third time. And so, Robo Rapist Knights, that you like to boast about how you're the ruler of this area or the whole world. For those of you on Jamaica Street or Pickens Street in the last 30, 36 years. See why I'm not into the gangster stuff? Harry never was. I'm not into the Blood Scripts MS-13 like you guys say. Or you guys spied on. See why I'm not into football and baseball, Harry, that you guys really threw the tizzy fit for? Everything that you guys have engaged in on, you adults taking pieces with Dave and all that from me and my dad and whoever else. Like I said, they're letting you claim that it's yours, Joe, but you grifted it like Ellery, the great to Google, every attempt to re-piece it back together. So they let you guys tell your war story, your battle. But it can be tracked, and your fourth country in Western can be tracked, and that's the way it is. So as you guys made your advance into the nation, stealing stuff, stealing people's stuff and screwed it up, it also shows Perlita's advance out with you, Joe, which leads to what? Guess what? Rapist Bridges Joe. Of the peaches, of the turquoise, whatever, Joe. The blue, all that stuff that you guys have done. And that's why you guys don't evolve. That's why I don't believe it belonged to the Negroes. Or the baldy East Coast Negro or Red Randy or Red Gordon because you all work on the same team, Bernard. So it doesn't matter if I tell them or not because you guys have made the basically your de declaration of war. And so obviously those entities that watch over that stuff, Perlita trying to claim to be Santa Claus, oh, we got him. No, Perlita, they watch your retreat or your supposed claim of victory of Texas or Mexico and they find who the pain in the ass, who do the face mutilations, and the eye poking, and all that shit. Indian Joe. Rapist of the Golden. That he tries to swap with the Fairmount. Whispering faggot at the Fairmount and the Maltese Night Crusties. So if that's the way you guys want the culture to be in hillbilliness, guess what? That's why Red Randy, when you screw with shit that's not yours, are you Harry, you guys kidnapped him, and you move stuff around, guess what? The junk pile that you guys make and carry through the nation no matter what direction. That's why those kids split after Harry and then booted people out or Karen. You guys kicked the kids out, started moving stuff around or whatnot. And then the kids split. And then he comes back with his bullshit story. You killed Kim! They're letting you do it. They're actually letting you and Harry, um, DJ Dave, Bella Morad, and Harry and you guys and Perlita prove your, to yourselves. How big a dumbass as you are. And like I said, Stolen Rainbow Joe, you steal it, big fat ass. Ellery steals a piece, big fat ass. Elton Don, same thing. Because you're running a con and a scam. So Joe, like I said, I can prove pretty much you're the one that crashed the ship and then blamed it on the boy. And then Ellery and them come down, steal the ship. Then blame the boy. Now next is the Google. Steal that too. Blame the boy. Then it's your cycle, hillbillies. And that's why nothing is done, because you guys steal it and kill over it multiple times that they've showed me, and nothing else gets done, because you guys are either doing cover-ups or you're stealing other people's shit. So whatever you want to claim, Robo Rapist Knight, and your team, but uh, you guys got to re-strategize to figure out, even when I'm gone, how to fix the mess that you created the 19 trillion dollars of crazy LGBT cowboy. And I don't want to be LGBT, and that's why I didn't want to help the Negroes, because I already had stuff, and other people had stuff who were working together that you guys trashed. Which ultimately means, Joe, you screwed over Ron Miller's stuff, or David Kent's stuff, over those same two girls, because a group of you guys just want to stick your dick where it don't belong, dudes. And I didn't want your dick in my ass, Joe. And your kill hillbilly barn. But if you guys have to have your showboat did not stop, guess what? There's the history of your battle that you write and that you actually do, Joe. Which is actually reality now. Which can be traced and tracked forever and ever and ever, wherever you guys run with Perlita.
So like I said, Joe, I'm glad that you guys think she's the greatest screw in the world, but I really don't give a shit. But it'll follow you forever. <laughs>